Everyone has their 4th of July traditions. In fact, Cuff and I are both usually up early running our favorite 5K on the holiday. We've actually missed it the last two years. Yes. So we're up early this year because of golf. Yes. So we had to be out here early. But for 100 other Quad Cityans, today was a perfect day to take advantage of both. Jenna Miner has more on that story. Yeah, the 4th of July is usually filled with grilling and fireworks, but for one Quad Cityan, today looked a lot different. Dino Leone ran in the Firecracker Run earlier this morning and spent the rest of his day right here at the John Deere Classic. Two great events that have a big impact on the Quad Cities, and they both happen to hit on the same day. Every 4th of July for the past six years. Can you get your, your, uh, your bib? I got it. Oh, okay. Dino Leone has run in the firecracker in East Moline. It brings the community together. Um, it promotes good health, and uh, that's so important. Everyone's celebrating the holiday while doing something they love. So the great thing about it is you build your support network, right? So no matter if you get hurt, somebody's going to walk with you. Um, if you uh, want to run faster, there's always a tier in, within our group that can run faster. This year, over 3,000 people took to the streets in East Moline, the most ever. Today is a record level for this race, and that is so neat watching these races grow. But this isn't the only big event going on this 4th of July. Uh, one that Dino is very excited about. I love to see the John Deere Classic. We have some new players this year coming back. Um, and uh, at the pro level, I mean, ranked like within the 30, uh, within 30 of uh, the uh, world. Just think of that, being the top 30 of the world, playing here in the Quad City. So uh, if you can't appreciate that, you can't appreciate much. As someone who appreciates both running and golf, Dino says it's the best of both worlds. Highlighting Quad Cities and all we have to offer here. Um, and I'm sure people come here and find uh, the friendly faces of the Quad Cities and want to come back. It was a day full of celebrating America. Woo! The John Deere Classic. And the Quad Cities. Every person that participated in the firecracker run got a ticket to the John Deere Classic. Leon says every year he goes one day, and this year he's grateful it got to be two. Back to you guys. Cuff, as you mentioned, we didn't get to run it this year. Our families did get out they did. and represent. Yeah. Hopefully we get to do it someday real, real soon. Some soon. Yeah. <laughs>